Hey guys, it's Beauty Butterfly. I'm coming to y'all with a grunge look. Um, I've been really wearing a lot of purple. Um, and one of the girls at school suggested that maybe I should do a grunge video. So I'm going to come on here and attempt to do a grunge look, which is basically like a dark purplish, purple lip, just dark purple. Um, and just black and just a darker um, type look. Um, so I'm going to try to attempt to do this look for you all. I'm all about the neutral. So um, like I said, lately I've been wearing some purple. So I think I'm, you know, blossoming into using some different colors. So if you want to see the grunge look that I came up with, just continue to watch. All right. So I'm going to come right out of my rose gold um, brush collection from BH Cosmetics. And I'm going to be using my Morphe Brushes palette, um, the 35B palette. And uh, as you can see, they have some amazing purple colors in here. And I'm going to start off with my transition color. And it's going to be this pink color. Also, I will be using Oatmeal Tan from Coastal Scents. go ahead and do my brow bone color I'm um, just going to be this tan color right here I'm just going to use a small little brush I'm just going to get a little bit of that on it All right, and if you ever feel like you've gone back in with too much brow bone color, take the same blending brush that you had, do not add any extra product, and just go in and just kind of buff it out. All right, um, so moving on to my lid, I'm going to actually be doing two colors. And those two colors are going to be this light purple. And then I'm also going to be using um, Deep Eggplant from Coastal Scents. And then I'm going to also be using a little bit of this purple um, out of the Missy Lynn palette from BH Cosmetics. And I'm just using a flat brush. I'm just going to get a little bit of that lighter purple on and I'm going right into my onto my lid and next I'm going to go on to the Missy Lynn palette get a little bit of that purple on the same brush Then I'm going to go into the Deep Eggplant from Coastal Scents. I'm actually going to change my brush to this little, to this brush, and it has like a, a curve to it. So it's going to help, that's going to help me apply this right there. And then with this brush, I'm going to go right in my crease with this dark purple and this lighter purple or lavender, whichever one you want to call it. All right. I'm going to take another crease brush. I'm going to go with this black right here at the bottom just to deepen that crease just a little bit more. All right. All right, so I'm gonna go back in with my blending brush and I'm gonna grab some of this purple. Kind of brush that. 
it right down that middle section. Um, and then with makeup, a lot of times, most of the times, um, before you add your liner, it just kind of looks weird. But I feel like liner is that icing on the cake that just ties your makeup in. Um, so that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and apply my liner. Um, and then I'm also going to be applying some lashes today. So, I've already applied my liner, as you all can see. So, I'm going to go and apply some lashes. All right, y'all. So, I have my lashes on. I'm um, just waiting for the glue to dry. All right. So, moving on to my under eye, I am going to be applying some of these edgy eggplant and this is a color by coastal scents take it on to that same brush i added that other eggplant color i'm just going to brush this and i'm just going to brush this on the bottom all right and then i'm just going to take my sephora black pencil and just go on the bottom part of my waterline all right you guys so i went back in and did some highlighting and contouring and i used the rose gold color out of the missy limb palette to do my highlighting all right lastly i'm just going to do my lips i'm going to use my eos and just moisturizing just a tad now I'm going to take my NK pencil in dark brown that I got from my local beauty supply store. I'm going to go ahead and line my lips. All right, and then I'm going to be using two lipsticks, um, and they're all the Wet n Wild lipsticks. I'm going to be using Vamp It Up, and then you all have seen me wear this before. And I'm also going to use one that I just got today. And it is in the color Sugar Plum. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and put Vamp It Up on first, and then I'll put um, Sugar Plum on as well. All right, and then I'm going to go in with my Sugar Plum. I'm just going to put that right in the middle. Alright, so this is the lipstick. And like I said, it's Vamp It Up and Sugar Plum. And these are both Wet n Wild lipsticks. Alright, you all, so this is my take on the grunge look. If you have any questions about anything that you've seen in this video, please leave them in the comment space down below. Don't forget to thumbs this video up and subscribe.